hello youtubers now in this video i will solving one of the problem which uh, some of the people faces while interfacing esp8266 wi-fi module with their arduino board uh, via software serial so the older version firmware of esp8266 works on uh, 115200 baud rate now while interfacing uh, this module with uh, via software serial of uh, arduino board so software serial unable uh, is unable to communicate at this much high speed of uh, 115200 so the data we get uh, is uh, you know noisy or scrambled data we get let's see with an example so i have i am uploading this uh, software serial example in my arduino mega board so the software serial pin i have attached is 10 and 11 in uno it will be different so see i actually i will change my baud rate of my esp8266 uh, to 115200 and of my Arduino will Arduino's bought it to be 9600. Okay, so I uploaded this and let's see by entering any 80 commands. Okay, so for this 80 command, it is perfectly working. Uh, what if we write another 80 command? Let's say 80 plus JMR. This is uh, 80 command for checking the version. So, as you can see, that this data got scrambled or uh, unreadable, so it is not able to communicate with this. Uh, Arduino board at uh, this much higher baud rate. So the solution is that uh, we need to change the baud rate of this module. Now changing the baud rate uh, is also quite easy. Uh, I will show you how to change. Uh, you need to connect uh, the. You need to make the connection like this. And uh, before making connection. Uh, just upload the blank code because after making this for connection the program will won't get uploaded onto your board so first of all upload the code and then make the connection okay done uploading okay so open the serial monitor now we'll change the border to 115200 and let's see okay it is working so at this baud rate it's perfectly working now the 80 command for changing the baud rate is 80 plus cio bu80 baud and and uh, we need to write our desired baud rate which is 9600 so it is uh, done so we can now communicate with this model at this baud rate okay so it is perfectly working and by changing the baud rate and now you can uh, attach uh, this model with software serial and you can go for your work but uh, I experienced that uh, in my older firmware version of uh, ESP8266, this 80 command, which is 80 plus CIO BAUD, so 80 plus, uh, for changing the baud rate, this 80 command was not at all working in that older version of firmware, older firmware version. So the solution for this is that we need to upgrade the firmware of this ESP8266. Now, how to upgrade? Let's see. Uh, so for firmware updating, you need to uh, let the circuit as it is as we have uh, made before that is the RXTX are connected to the 0 and 1 pin of Arduino then I will be providing the link of this uh, folder in my blog so you need you will get this much of files and you need to open no first of all let's see in readme files so it is written that bin that is 9.4.5.0 version will have the default baud rate of 9.6.0 while 9.5.2 version will have default baud rate of 11.5.2.0 so in this video i will be updating with this uh, version now how to update uh, first of all you need to open this esp266 flasher then uh, you need to attach uh, you know browse for this uh, <coughs> firmware 9.5.0 and you need to uh, write the com port uh, now you can see the com port from this sorry uh, from uh, your arduino board that which com port your arduino is connected you need to write that com port so here my com port is 5 so i will write um, yeah f5 and i will click simply the download button and uh, okay before that one thing i forgot to tell you that uh, whenever you are updating your firmware you need or you must need to connect that gpio 0 pin of esp8266 to, to ground so i'm connecting that pin to the ground and again uh, uploading this or doing the same procedure again uh, com5 uh, it says fail to connect ok I think this I need to close this window and uh, 
okay so it is uh, working now erasing flash okay so it has started is uh, you know updating procedure so likewise you can update your firmware it will take some time okay so the firmware update procedure is done and it's successfully done so now you can you now you can open your Arduino board and uh, communicate with this module at the uh, baud rate 9600 as this firmware default baud rate is uh, 9600 and in this firmware you can even change the baud rate to any uh, whichever baud rate you want just like AT plus CIO BAUD is equal to 1152200 and it is done so you can communicate it with that baud rate also so it is so easy to update and so easy to use this Wi-Fi module and uh, with this 9600 board right, you can definitely use that software serial and uh, okay so thanks for watching